Okay, so in this video you're going to learn how to play the Phantom Pain as a different character. Um, now in order to do this you have to um, change the character before you, well sorry, at the start of a mission, so when you're, when you're choosing the mission. Um, in order to do it you have to have progressed so far in the game that you have established a combat unit. So you start the mission as you would normally, then you go into um, that page and select the character. Now you can see the current character by default is Snake. Um, if you click on Snake, um, you will see here are listed all the members of the combat team. And you can scroll down and select any one of them. Now you might want, to, if you look over on the right at the individual person's skill set, you may want to choose someone with um, specific skills for the job and um, play him for that mission. Um, so I think I'm going to play as a woman just to be different. I think I've only got the one on my team at the moment. Um, she's uh, only a level D in combat, so I'm not sure how that's going to go. Um, she's not the most glamorous, not that quiet, I'm afraid. And um, she only seems to have the uniform. She's got a choice of headgear of a balaclava. Um, mm, a bit of a ninja there. No, I don't really think I like that. <coughs> so um, I'll deselect that again. So here she is, Thunder Panda. That's who we're going to play as. So we'll choose her and um, then start the mission as you would normally. And um, then you'll be playing as that character um, for the rest of the mission. So here she is on the um, helicopter. Um, no scars. I wonder if she'll end up covered in blood. I suppose she will. And I'll just show you, it's just the same as, as when you play with Snake really, the usual routine, get out the helicopter and to get on the horse and start the mission. So I think um, it took me a while to work this one out and I think a lot of people have been um, wondering how you do it. So I hope that's helpful and thanks for watching.